guys welcome back to my channel today's video is a vlog today is tuesday november 23rd where has the month gone literally where has the month gone it's already the end of the month i don't know i feel like i just blinked and the month is almost over oh okay let me just give you a quick update i just posted a vlog from last week today so you've probably already seen it hopefully you've seen it if you have then thank you guys i have read three books this week three books i am getting back into the romance books like i've always loved and i'm so happy about that because it has been getting me out of a funk and i appreciate it so much so i just figured romance is my type of books you guys so i'm still going to read my book tbr but i just don't know if i will ever finish it on my goodreads i've read 20 books so far this year and i am so proud of myself <laughs> Cause I set a goal of 12 books, which was one book a month, but I'm on book 20. I just feel so excited. Honestly, I'm at book 22 because the two books that I read are not on good good reads for some reason. I'm gonna try to search for it, but let me show you what two books I'm talking about. I am getting into manga. Yes, I am, girl. What? Who is she? After watching a few vlogs, I thought about anime and starting to read manga oh let me go check my food real quick i'm back i had to make sure my food did not explode i'm making chili and i will show you that in a few minutes but i'm reading manga now and after watching two booktubers like read manga i was like hmm could i really get into manga i heard it's just like anime is not my thing it's just weird but i googled it and they have romance manga who would have thought who would have thought? Me. I did not even think about it. So here I am reading manga for the first time and I'm in love. So I found two romance mangas that I read and I literally read these in one day. I had to order the next books. These two books are very popular for the romance mangas. I could not find them in any of the nearest bookstores near me like within 400 miles so I had to order them online and I'm really happy that they are really cheap because girl if they were 20 bucks I would not do it <laughs> but they're only $10 and I just I love these series and I'm going to probably buy the whole series for both of these so that means I need to get another bookshelf anyways I read these two this is happy marriage and it is so cute I cannot wait to read the next also, I finished this one, which is Midnight Secretary. Oh my god. This was really good. It caught my eye, and I really like it. So, I've ever read, and I'm now on the manga hype train. So, love these. And then, romance books that I finished is The Black Dagger Brotherhood, um, book two, which is Lover Eternal. I read that on my Kindle. I bought it on Friday. No, Saturday, and I finished it yesterday, which was Monday. I went out with my friend for her birthday on the weekend, and I didn't have a chance to read it, so I read it literally Sunday night and Monday. That's insane. Okay, so that is juicy. I forgot how great this series is, and I'm in love. I just ordered the next book on Monday. My packages arrived, so we're going to open up this package and see what books I got. I can't buy any more books for the rest of the month because this package was expensive. Um, I think I might get the next romance books on Kindle and then just buy the books after I'm finished because I ate that romance book up. Like, oof, oof, baby. I picked up Dune because I went to go see Dune last Thursday, Wednesday or Thursday, and it was so great. I'm gonna read Dune. I'm excited to start that. I don't know when I'll start it, but ooh, Timothy. Ooh, honey, he is, he is. That's all I gotta say, he is. Okay, so the first book I got is Love you, Lover Awakened. This is the third book in the series. Oh my god, I cannot wait. Oh my god, I cannot wait to have the whole series on my shelf. It looks so beautiful. So this is the third book. My first book I actually read when I went to Florida um, months ago and I actually left it on the airplane. So whoever picks that book up, you're welcome. <laughs> Oh, the next book is, oh, this is the manga Happy Marriage number four. I don't know if I can read them out of order because I know the second book is not here yet. It'll be here on Sun Friday. And then this is Happy Marriage book three. Three and four. Here they are. Um, so we're just missing, we're just missing book two 
which is crazy. Oh, and I'm missing Midnight Secretary book two as well. So I have two more books coming in. Okay, and then this book, I saw this on TikTok and I heard it is very, very, mmm, ooh. I can't wait. And I had to get it in hardcover because it was cheaper. So, yeah. This is All Hill Ever Ever Be, W. Winters. Ooh, I heard this is deliciously sexy and mm, I cannot wait. This hardcover is like extremely hardcover. It feels like it, the hardest of the hardcovers that I have. I'm gonna read this first because I just finished <laughs> the second book last night and I wanted more. I almost bought it on Kindle, but I knew that this book was coming. So I'm gonna read this first and let's go check out my chili. Okay, guys, <laughs> it is a little too hot. It's a little too hot. Um, I'm cooking tomato juice, carrots, celery, onions, and some noodles. So basically this is a <laughs> vegetarian chili. I do have ground beef that is thawing, so it's not gonna make it in this batch, but this is just the rest of my tomato juice that I wanted to use it for chili, so it's okay. And then I added a bunch of spices so I, it could be spicy. I added my favorite seasoning, cayenne pepper. I also added slap your mama because this is also the best to make your food a little spicy. So that's what I used and I cannot wait. Let's try it. Oh yeah, yes. I don't think the noodles are done yet so that's gonna keep cooking. I'm gonna turn it down this time. Actually, I'll just leave the lid off and let it simmer for about 15 15 minutes and then I will check back in it on it in 10 minutes. So yeah Okay, you literally can't see me. So I have my brightness turned up a little bit. Here is my dish It is so it was supposed to be goulash, but I forgot to thaw out the meat So it's just a vegetarian goulash slash chili. So let me show you. So this is what it looks like has noodles, my favorite noodles. I think it's called rotini. So I love them. Carrot, and I chopped up some celery, and there's some onions in there. So that is what I'm having for lunch. Hi guys, welcome back. Today is Saturday, November 27th, and I'm just feeling a little like, I don't know, I'm not feeling sick. I'm just not feeling happy. Oh my gosh. Like, look at the bags. I've been staying up way too late. Yeah, yesterday I was going to film and get all my filming done for the week, but just, it's, I just did not feel good. And I think it's because my grandma has COVID, so I did not get to go home to my family's Thanksgiving and see any of my siblings or my grandma. She's doing okay. Her breathing is fine. Her heart is fine. Her lungs are fine. It's just, she lost her taste and she had the body aches for a few days. Um, I'm gonna actually call her after I get done filming this part because I haven't talked to her in a day. So, um, but she was able to eat Thanksgiving meal even though she couldn't taste it. So I called them and had a FaceTime call with them on Thanksgiving, which was nice. Um, so if you could just keep me in your prayers, I would really appreciate it. She is the only one left in our family, like as an adult on our side because my dad passed away my mom hasn't, hasn't been in the picture for a while, so, and my grandpa passed away years ago when I was in fifth grade, like, I don't know how many years ago, but yeah, so, if you could keep me in your prayers, that would be really great. So I think I'm just feeling very sad, and I'm just so scared. Yeah, I was going to film a bunch of stuff, but I guess I would rather just film a vlog, because I really don't want to put makeup on and get ready and whatnot, so. This is what you get. It's actually laundry day. It's Saturday. I am doing all the laundry. I'm doing my blankets, my sheets, and clothing. So I have clothes for the week. And I think it's just going to be a chill day. So I made chili last night. It was really good. I made it again. <laughs> but I made it a different way. So to talk to you guys about the books I've been reading. So I've been reading manga books. And I know it's so different for me. I'm on book four of Happy Marriage. I bought the first book last week um and then i read it in like a few hours so i bought the next three books there is all four that i have 
I don't know how many are in this series. I think there's about 10 or more. So, um... I just have the first four. I'm going to wait like a week or two before I get the next four just because I have been spending too much money on Amazon lately, so I need to take a break. But I'm loving this series. It's really good, and <laughs> I just really like it. It's so cute. Also, like I said, I read Midnight Secretary number one. I do have number two arriving on Monday, I believe. So that is what's going on. Um, I started reading Shadow and Bone. I should pr really pick up on it because I haven't even got... I think I'm on the third chapter. So I need to keep reading this. And I've also been reading um, the Black Dagger Brotherhood series from J.R. Ward. I read book one, book two on my Kindle. This is book three. Book four, I'm reading this on my Kindle as well. So I'm on book four already and I'm just going to keep buying the series. I think I'm going to read them on Kindle first and then just buy the whole series when I'm done. Just because I can't wait for Amazon to pick them up. So I honestly feel like I should just drive the hour away just to go pick up the rest of the series. So I don't buy the Kindle books, but I mean the Kindle books are like two two dollars cheaper. Um, so yeah, I've been reading my Kindle a lot because of this series. And honey, it's nice. <laughs> so these are my two books I'm reading today. Um, I'm also still reading Ted Bundy, his interviews. I'm just gonna take my time with that because it is so heavy and crazy. It's just gonna it's sitting downstairs right next to the to our couch as a just um as just a little book to read randomly so that's what i'm going to do i'm going to take my time i should read some of that tonight these are the two books on my list today as i'm doing chores and yeah pretty much not doing much just trying to get myself back into the groove of just being okay just i feel off and i don't know why i wanted to go to the gym today but it is snowing so bad my car is already is under a bunch of snow and it's only one o'clock let me let me let me show you a beautiful winter wonderland is what we have there is so much snow and i don't think it's gonna stop so i don't think i'm gonna go to the gym today i will probably just do a workout later downstairs and just get back into that so i'm gonna go back downstairs and start reading and i'll catch up with you guys in a little bit hi guys update <laughs> my hair is a mess i'm going to braid it but let me hold on a second so i'm playing animal crossing i bought the happy home academy something like that and it was like 25 dollars. but i don't like it i really don't like it i've only played it this is my third time playing it so my opinion so far is that i don't like it pretty much <laughs> so i well okay so i do like the whole part of going to islands and getting the gourds or whatever they're called but i just don't like the whole part of having to decorate different villagers islands and their houses because i can't even decorate my island with the materials that i have because my items suck like i have been playing animal crossing for a year now and all my items that i have to decorate my island suck they suck big time so that's really annoying also i just i don't know how i feel about it anyways what was i gonna talk about so it is black friday weekend like saturday did i not get any jars i didn't get any jar what the heck i'm on an, an island and i didn't get a jar so i will mention this in another video but i bought my black friday item that i wanted for so long for over a year and that is the cricket explore air 2 and it's in the mint grain one that's gonna be really fun to use once it arrives i'm um, now i'm looking on best buy because okay also i'm drinking wine at 4 p.m it's 4 30 now but is it too early to drink wine i think not and it's a blizzard so there's nothing else to do so here's the deal <laughs> i don't even know where to start i'm a, i had one sip of wine and i'm already feeling it that's where we're at um okay wine chats with courtney i had one sip of wine and i'm already feeling it so we're off to a great start for black friday i bought my cricket that i've always been wanting so i can make some oh my god i have a nest in my hair you guys what is going on with my hair so i bought a cricket so that i can make some things and i'm super excited for that so that's gonna be really great to open on christmas i still need to buy a christmas tree the new macbook pros i will be getting one i'm going to upgrade probably for my birthday i think 
we'll see how my financials go but yes i'm so excited i really want the computer just because it has more storage it has 16 gigabyte and i'm pretty sure my um 2019 macbook pro that i have it only has what is it probably like eight gigabytes and 500 and something on the disc which i don't like so i've been looking into getting hard drive so that i can plug it in and use that for my videos because the amount of storage that i use up filming videos and editing them on my computer i have to clean my computer and erase all of the stuff like every few months and just wipe out my whole computer which is really insane so i'm looking into getting a hard drive so let's see if the one i want is on sale Although the one that I want is not even expensive, so I could get it. I've just been lazy, lady, lazy, lazy about it. So the uh, portable hard drive that I want, the external hard drive, is the lacy rugged USB C to C two TB hard drive. Oh, the MacBook Pro that I want is twenty five hundred dollars. So I will be getting that for my birthday next year for sure. But let me read about it. This is what I want to get. Everyone has it. All the YouTubers have it. It is 2,000 gigabytes, which is great. I really need that. And it's only $110. I feel like that was cheaper than it was because it is Black Friday. So, ooh, should I get it? Rugged portable drive, which I definitely need for my computer. So, because I need the storage. So yeah, um, I'm gonna wait on it, but I really do like it. I don't know if I'm gonna get it yet. I still have the rest of today and tomorrow to think about it, so we'll see. But that is on my wish list. So yeah, I'm going to drink my wine, play some Animal Crossing, and then do a little reading and then catch you guys up. We've just been chilling here. Leo's been outside like four times. He's having fun playing in the snow. Phoenix is just laying down. And I think I'm going to put on the British Baking Championship the holiday one. So that's what I'm going to do for now. And I will catch you guys up later. Probably when my hair is braided. So, And I might be drunk. So enjoy. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm ending the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this long vlog. I know I talked a little bit too much, but sometimes lately I've been needing just to have a little chat. I had really good wine last night. It was so good. I didn't get drunk, which is <laughs> which is good, but I did feel a little better after everything and I did do a little shopping. Now I am going to Starbucks and I'm gonna go hang out there for a while, upload a video and just chill out for the day it is a very snowy still and it's still snowing so let me show you there's my car getting warmed up so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog if you did don't forget to like and subscribe down below and i will see you in my next video bye mm -hmm.